Did you know the brightest planet in our sky is putting on one of its most beautiful shows tonight? Venus is glowing next to a fiery red star and two legendary star clusters. And the view is stunning. This isn't just rare. It's the kind of alignment sky watchers wait years for. Even if you're not into astronomy, this is one of those nights that pulls your eyes upward. Stay with me because this sky is about to surprise you. If you step outside tonight and glance toward the western sky just after sunset, you'll notice something that outshines everything else, a stunning, diamond-like glow. That's Venus, and tonight, it's at its most brilliant, shining at a magnitude of 4.1, which makes it the third brightest object in the sky after the sun and moon. Unlike stars that flicker, Venus gives off a steady, piercing light, clear and bold. You might even mistake it for an airplane at first glance. This brightness isn't random. Venus is currently in an ideal position in its orbit, known as its greatest elongation, which allows us to see more of its sunlit side from Earth. And because it's relatively close to us, just about 75 million kilometers away, it radiates with extraordinary intensity. Even if you're not into astronomy, this is the perfect moment to connect with something bigger. Let Venus be your cosmic reminder. Even in darkness, brilliance can rise. If you've been feeling lost or distracted lately, just look up. Sometimes, one bright light is enough to guide you. So take a few minutes tonight. Step outside, no telescope needed. Just you, the sky, and Venus putting on a once-in-a-season show. Tonight, Venus isn't shining alone. It's having a close celestial encounter with Aldebaran, the brightest star in the constellation Taurus. Aldebaran has a warm, reddish-orange glow and is often called the Eye of the Bull because of its position in the V-shaped hyades cluster that outlines Taurus's face. What makes tonight special is that Venus will appear unusually close to Aldebaran in the sky, forming a striking visual duo icy white Venus and fiery red Aldebaran side by side. This color contrast is truly a treat for the eyes. Venus, with its reflective cloud cover, beams a steady cool light, while Aldebaran, a red giant nearing the end of its life, burns with deep, warm intensity. To the naked eye, it may feel like two different worlds colliding, one soft and divine, the other bold and ancient. Their closeness is purely visual. These two are nowhere near each other in space. But from our earthly perspective, they align in a way that feels meaningful, like a cosmic reminder of duality, the balance between logic and passion, clarity and intensity. So if you've ever needed a reason to pause and look up, let it be this moment of cosmic contrast, a beautiful alignment we rarely get to witness. Just above Venus in tonight's sky, you'll find a delicate cluster of stars that has fascinated humans for thousands of years, the Pleiades, also known as the Seven Sisters. This shimmering group is part of the constellation Taurus, and while it contains hundreds of stars, the brightest six or seven can be seen with the naked eye. What makes tonight truly magical is how close Venus appears to this ancient cluster, almost as if it's reaching up to touch them. This isn't just visually stunning, it's emotionally stirring. The Pleiades have deep roots in mythology across cultures. The Greeks saw them as seven sisters fleeing the hunter Orion. In Japan, they're called Subaru, symbolizing unity and connection. When Venus aligns near them, it adds a sense of intimacy to the vast night sky, as if the goddess of beauty is visiting the celestial sisters. If you have binoculars, you'll get an even clearer view. The icy sparkle of the Pleiades, contrasted with Venus's steady glow, is absolutely mesmerizing. But even without tools, 
This rare alignment invites us to simply stop and connect to the stars, to myth, and to ourselves. Take a breath, look up, and witness a reunion written in light. While the Pleiades often steal the spotlight, another remarkable star cluster quietly adds depth to tonight's sky. The Hyades. Located just beside Aldebaran, the Hyades form a distinct V-shape that outlines the face of Taurus, the celestial bull. This is actually the closest open star cluster to Earth, sitting just 150 light-years away, and its stars are among the easiest to identify with the naked eye. Tonight, the Hyades act as a cosmic stage framing the meeting of Venus and Aldebaran. Their subtle silver glow stretches across the sky like a delicate net, surrounding the bold reddish star of Aldebaran. Though it's important to note, Aldebaran is not actually part of the cluster. It just happens to lie in the same line of sight. What makes the Hyades special is not just their brightness, but their symbolism. In ancient times, they were called the Rainbringers, associated with seasonal changes and emotional transitions. And tonight, as they form a backdrop to one of the most beautiful alignments of the season, they remind us that beauty often lies in quiet support, the kind that doesn't need to shine the brightest to be essential. So let your eyes linger here. The high aids are whispering stories older than we can imagine. Tonight's sky show comes with a beautiful bonus, the waning gibbous moon. Just a few days past full, this phase offers a bright yet softer lunar presence that enhances the cosmic scene without overpowering it. Unlike the intense spotlight of a full moon, the waning gibbous offers a more muted glow, casting gentle shadows and creating a peaceful atmosphere for stargazing. This phase symbolizes release and reflection in many spiritual traditions. It's the perfect time to slow down, let go of what no longer serves you, and gain clarity from recent experiences. There's something deeply calming about watching the moon in this phase. It's like a quiet exhale from the cosmos. Visually, the moonlight tonight will gently illuminate the surroundings, giving the stars and planets, especially Venus, Aldebaran, and the nearby clusters, a natural frame. You'll notice the sky has just enough contrast, not pitch black, but dim enough to allow the bright objects to truly stand out. So if you've been craving a moment of stillness or clarity, tonight's moon invites you to take it. Let its light wash over you as you take in the rare beauty of the alignment around it. Sometimes, the moon doesn't need to be full to be full of meaning. To catch this celestial masterpiece, timing and direction are everything. Right after sunset, head outdoors and face the western sky. As twilight deepens, Venus will appear first. Low on the horizon, shining like a cosmic beacon. The surrounding stars and clusters, including Aldebaran, the Pleiades, and the Hyades, will slowly reveal themselves as the sky darkens. Make sure to find a spot with a clear, unobstructed view of the western horizon. Away from tall buildings or trees, even a pair of binoculars can enhance the experience, but the real magic is that it's all visible with the naked eye. Tonight's alignment carries more than visual beauty. It echoes powerful symbolism. Venus, often linked to love and harmony, aligning near Aldebaran, a star of strength and clarity, suggests a union of heart and courage. The presence of the Pleiades, tied to ancient stories of divine guidance and feminine wisdom, adds layers of emotional insight. Spiritually, this moment encourages reflection on relationships, inner values, and intuitive clarity. Many ancient cultures saw such alignments as signs of awakening or divine messages. So, if you've been searching for a sign or a nudge forward, this night, this sky, 
might be speaking directly to you. Thanks for watching Wisdom Quest. Tonight's sky reminds us that beauty and meaning are always above us. Comment, I am aligned with the universe if you felt the magic too.